Hey everyone, it's Jeff. Uh, today I'd like to just talk to you about my three favorite knives. I know they're not going to be for everybody, but these are the ones that I like to take out when I'm out. So it's either on my hip, in my bag, in my car, somewhere with me. Take a quick look at them and then we'll turn the camera around and we'll get into them. First one is going to be the BPS Adventure Bushcraft Knife. Great knife, we'll get into that. Next on my list, Mora Garberg. Again, we'll get into those in a few minutes here. And my most favorite one would be the Bushcraft Black from Mora. Now it comes with this case, but we changed it out to a Scout case because I just wanted something different. So let me change the camera around and we'll get right back to you. Thanks. Okay, so we're going to start off with the BPS knife. Um, just to let you know, it is made out of 1066 carbon steel and comes with the leather sheath, ferro rod, dangler, or you can wear it on your belt loop. It is a full tang knife, which means the blade is one continuous piece from beginning to end. It does have a really good sharp 90 degree spine on it to throw sparks with the ferro rod. It is also a Scandi grind, which is really good. They're really easy to keep sharp. They stay razor sharp. The whole length of the knife is approximately 10 inches. The blade length is about five and three inches long. The handle length is four and a half inches and the blade width is 1.2 inches. Now it is a really good knife, like I said, very well made. It's not an expensive knife. So if you're on a budget, this is one of the better ones for you. Let me put this one away and we'll get on to the next one. So number two on my list would be the Mora Garberg. It comes in stainless and carbon. Again, this is one of Mora's so far only full tang knives. Yes, they do have another one out. Again, very sharp 90 degree spine. Scandi grind on it as well. Throw sparks like crazy. You got the little nub at the end here that you can use for spiking or using on your ferro. The blade rod. length on these is 109 millimeters. The blade thickness is 3.2 millimeters. Uh, the knife length is 229 millimeters and the total length is about 248 millimeters they're very light um, the majority of their cases do come with water holes in the bottom so if it's raining or if you have to cross a creek or river and you get some water in there it does help with the drainage now this one comes with what they classify as their survival kit which is a ferro rods included and a diamond sharpener on the side again these are both very good knives Gonna grab my next favorite knife here and we'll be right back to so you. So my most favorite knife so far, I think, is the Mora Bushcraft Black. Now it comes with this case here. I didn't really like it, I wanted something different. So like I said, we opted for the Scout case here. It is in carbon. It is not a full tang, it's a rat tang, which means as the blade is coming down here, it gets narrower and narrower, it ends around this area here. I will let you know, I have used this knife. I've batoned with it, I've chopped with it, I've carved with it, feather sticks with it, and I've never had an issue with it. It does have a really sharp 90 degree spine on the back for ferro rod and throwing sparks. Again, Scandi grind. Uh, the blade length is approximately 109 millimeters. Thickness is about three and a half, 3.2 to three and a half. Knife length is 232 millimeters and the total length is 258 millimeters again this is my favorite knife i try and take this one everywhere i go like i said it's either going to be on my hip in my bag or in my car and again very great knife like i said not all these knives aren't for everybody but they're my top three let me turn the camera around we'll get right back hey, to you. so like i said those are my three favorite knives they're probably not going to be for everyone but i'm a big mora fan Anybody that knows me knows that. Thanks for watching. I do appreciate your support. If you want to say anything or talk about your favorite knives, leave a comment in the box below. Thanks again.